Hello dear greetings of the day from all medical solutions. Today we are going to have a tool to add multi-branch custom modules where we can manage different locations of your business which are registered under single company. When we install this custom module, it adds a feature so you can have a record of branch or we can say information of a branch on the specific records. Let's say that on the invoices or on stock operations on the CRM, sale and customers. Obviously, if you have a different customers at different location, you can configure the branch on the customer and that customer will be visible to the specific person to whom they have access to that branch. If there is no branch on the customer, then that customer will be visible to all the branches users. So based on the need, you can install the specific module. Today we have installed the ACS HMS branch, which helps to manage hospital operations in the different operating units or we can say the branches. So once we install this module, it have installed all dependent modules over here. As you can see related to stock account and the base. Once we install this module, we will able to manage or we will get access to the specific stuff. Let's say that first of all, you will able to manage multiple branches over here. Under users menu, you will able to see the new menu branch and over here in the branch, you can create a number of branches whichever you have. Just you have to give the specific name and the company and related information can be also configured. If you have installed HMS multi-branch module, you will see this option. So you can configure consumption of the products location also per Right. That was the extra option for the HMS branch mode and this will be the common for all the branch modules. Once these uh, branches are configured, you can give access to the specific users to a specific branch. So let's say that on the user we want to give the access right. It will be same as the multi companies. Over here you can configure that allowed branches over here. Whatever branch we have, we can just give the access to the specific branch to the user and main branch can be configured. So when they log in, by default it will be the main branch and to whomever we want to give access to manage this multi-branch configuration same as multi-companies you have access right over here so you can give option that uh, multi-branch is option and that users will able to manage a multiple branch once we configure this uh, multiple branch for the specific user they will able to see this selection bar over here on the top and they can select the specific branch same as the multi-company but when they have more than one branches allocated on their account then only they will be able to see this okay so this was the basic configuration which we can have related to a multiple branch module and access right but after that let's say that uh, we are going to the contacts and we want to configure the specific access right to specific branch so currently i am in the main branch let's activate the naroda and baroda branch also so once i select these two branches it, all of three that will be showing me 120 contacts let's say that i'm the ebley capitalson we want to set the branch which is baroda okay and on another contact anita let's set a branch naroda okay now once we configured these two branches on two different contacts if I remove this Baroda access and see it will show me only 119 contacts and that contact is not visible at the moment if I remove the access of Naroda also Anita Oliver will be not accessible because I am accessing only main branch contacts as you can see okay, so this is the access right level which we have extra level of the access right or recovery we can say on the contact level as well as on other report and other operations also now for the medical or hospital operations on the patient level also you will be able to see a same access right let's say that uh, we have john peter patient and on this patient also you will be able to set a branch let's say that we configure the a branch over here let's say first we need to have an access right otherwise it will not allow us to set this or access it so i have this naroda branch on the john peter in total patients are 36 let's say that i remove access for the naroda and see that 
you know that is removed all the access wherever we have configured branch as a Narora. If we do not have any branch on the content that will be visible to all the branches or the users without any restriction. Same way on the appointment and other operations also you will be able to see a branch configuration so you can filter or get the records based on the branch itself. Hope this video was helpful to you. If you have any confusion or requirement related to the multiple branch, you know, you can contact us on any official channel or click here.